song is not boyfriend or closer. But thank you for requesting them there, I assure you, in the set. Exactly, exactly where you'll want them to be. We know, we trust us, we know when you should hear them. Think of it like a good meal that only we are qualified to serve you. where uh, we thought a lot about your needs uh, and then also a little bit about our needs and things that we really care about. <laughs> and th these next two songs are both songs that I wrote and they're both sort of... They're not called the con because Tegan just already played that. Uh, <laughs> it's actually my version of the con. <laughs> in just a half a step above Tegan. No, it's, uh, there are two songs that are uh, both sort of strangely linked, even though I didn't really think about either one of them uh, at the time that I was writing them. I was thinking about, uh, I was thinking about very different things, and yet the content sort of feels connected. Canada's great and super cool and super progressive, and being gigantically gay our entire life. how profoundly fucked up it is for most people. And uh, we are very grateful for, uh, for, 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 the, for, the, for the government, but also just for our family and friends. It was sort of, um, you know, it was just a lucky break that we got parents and grandparents and friends who uh, didn't, didn't push us out or ostracize us when we came out. And, um, Superficial, uh, superficial cues, but a lot of you don't seem uh, to be gay. Maybe you are, I don't know. Um, but some of you uh, seem really gay, obviously. This part of the audience is, yeah, there's some gays around. Uh, but some of you aren't, and I, I think there is an important thing to be said. In our career, we've spent a lot of time acknowledging and thanking the people in the LGBT community for supporting us before a lot of people did. And, one thing that has come from us changing our sound and our audience expanding and reaching more people and a lot of different kinds of people is an opportunity to also talk to the people who aren't in the LGBT community because you have an opportunity to make really different kind of change in people's lives. For us, we didn't have very many gay people in our lives growing up and the gay people that were in our life were closeted or didn't talk about it and that was normal and it, it still is in a lot of communities. And one of the things that we want to do, what we've always kind of done, but want to really do moving forward is be comfortable and talk about who we are so that people in our audience never feel like they don't have someone out there that they can look up to or feel like, yeah, fuck Tegan and Sarah, talk about who they are, I'm gonna talk about who I am. And the people in this audience who have been good supports us. We're really grateful for you. And never underestimate the power that you have in making somebody feel like they can be in a safe space and talk about who they are, regardless of their sexuality or gender. And these two songs are sort of about that.
Oh, oh, oh.